Hello, Bill. Another beautiful day or night. Yep. Hope your five senses work. Health and strength is good. What? And to you Steam Deck fans again, what's up? Steam Deck Tribe, Steam Deck Nation, Steam Deck Universe, Steam Deck World, Steam Deck Legion, what's good? Steam Deck Mob, mm -hmm. and the Steam Deck Squad, what's up with it? So, you can make a stand, you can make a stand out of Legos for the Steam Deck, huh? Lego, savvy Lego Steam Deck builders, huh? <laughs> you Steam Deck fans, man. Valve, you see what you didn't create for these Steam Deck fans? They'll, they're trying anything with the Steam Deck now. They got Legos. Who knows what's next, man? <laughs> anyway, says here, says here, this Lego Steam Deck stand give the 3D printing a run for its money. A savvy Steam Deck fan has whipped up a Lego stand for the handheld gaming PC and has proved you don't need a 3D printer to create custom accessories. <laughs> says here, a Steam Deck enthusiast put some of their Lego bricks to use by creating a stand, offering up a great way to recycle and save money on the accessories. The idea could also help players make some custom accessories without the aid of a 3D printer, especially if, if you already got old bricks lying around. It says here, assembled by Q Qnix, the, the Lego Steam Deck stand proved that unlike kids these days, you don't need a 3D printer to make custom accessories. A series of image shows off the add-on demonstrating the ability to house the portable uh, PC snugly. <laughs> says here, while also supporting a section that holds a solid solid tech axe three four one zero u mini usb uh, keyboard mm. say q snicks goes on to say their steam deck lego stand also folds so it's can fit inside a bag with holding the device securely and the action of the usb keyboard it's an effective and cheap method of turning valve pc into a a makeshift gaming laptop plus it puts old pc old pieces of new use the realm of toys and modern tech mm. yeah they they're they're they're, do, they're doing this man <laughs> these steam deck fans are just going off the head that's trying anything with this thing now well it's a part of the pc family so yeah um you 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 bet you bet you best believe that um if you can do a lot of things with PC, the Steam Deck fans that are also PC fans are going to try it. It says, unfortunately, there's no instruction on how to build the Steam Deck stand, but it does seem to use many Legos, and there's enough in the image to get the idea of how it was put together while the add-on does move, does have moving parts. Anyone sufficiently experienced in building with iconic bricks should be able to recreate their own version from sight alone. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Then it says here, uh, for the for the more frugal gamer, a stand made from Lego bricks you may need to have lying around is a great way of saving money. The makeshift the makeshift accessory is no match for the best Steam Deck dock, mm -hmm. but it's certainly helpful if you if your USB hub lacks a stand or you want to take a keyboard with you. On the go, savvy Steam Deck fans, man. <laughs> you just like just like you can build a PC out of anything, you know. Even some wood, you can make a case out of it, you know. Just 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 using wood. So, um, uh, if you can do that with if you can do that with the Steam Deck, the Steam Deck fans are gonna try. But this one user used some Legos and made a stand to where you can. Turn your your Steam Deck into a laptop, basically, just like the article article says. So, yeah, um, uh, uh, Steam Deck fans right now just having fun with this thing. This thing is it's a good handheld, man. You know, and base a lot of people like it. You know, a lot of people really like it. You know, I mean, people try to make videos talking about they they, they hate the Steam Deck and all that, but to me, that's a publicity stunt. No, the Steam Deck is doing damage now, especially when you can run Xbox Game Pass and and um, play uh, PlayStation games on it and and all those storefronts that you have. It's definitely worth it, man. So yeah, but these fans are taking it to the extreme now. 
who knows what's next. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to leave this video for y'all to enjoy with the article. Nice talking to you people again. Chris, still Star Wars and Star Trek fan. Bored. Dark side. Go on.